Right base for 35 right, zero uniform tango, flight of two to the tower. So long. Experimental 250, uniform tango, uh, Louisville Tower, wind 31010, runway uh, 35 right, clear to line. And look at all those Whirlport jets, Jeep. <laughs> We're back here in Louisville, Kentucky uh, to support the UPS visit. I mean, electric aviation is here, right? We came out again, uh, charging on our own infrastructure, uh, flying our own aircraft. So it's, uh, it's massive uh, to be able to demonstrate how far along electric aviation has come and, and where we are right now. Call came out to be able to support this. Uh, we were able to respond in a relatively short amount of time to be able to get on the road. And you know, we had a couple little delays with weather, uh, but otherwise, you know, really smooth trip. We flew today through some of the busiest airspace in the United States through Cleveland, and then landing in Louisville is obviously very busy with the cargo operations here. So showing that you know electric airplanes can fit in just with normal airplanes in the real world. You know, we didn't make any special arrangements for this. I think it was a big gain for our operation. I think we're just going to continue to see gains in efficiency from here on. UPS has been a, an incredibly innovative and forward-leaning partner on this technology. Getting that sort of touch point with them, same as they get the touch point with the aircraft, is always motivating to our team, for sure. Yeah, how's that? Very good. So that commemorates what these guys set up, which nice, was the first special. flight of this aircraft for UPS. It flew here from uh, up in Vermont. Um, you want to sit in the cockpit? You would make my day if you did. How about that? We're up right up in the cockpit there, and you can sit in the first electric cargo aircraft. <laughs>